Yes, guys, and welcome to RG Handhelds once again. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Today, we got a special one. We're checking out a few goodies that were sent to me uh, by uh, a guy called Jim. Um, he has his own website, and he sells all these cool uh, products, or joysticks, and so on, um, from Arkness, uh, and mainly these... Uh, joysticks and these replaceable analog sticks for different types of joysticks he has sent me out just for a quick unbox uh, so we can go ahead and check these out guys um, so let's go ahead firstly and just quickly check out the the 8 bit old device which is a cool little device i have a few of these already uh, but this one looks like a pretty cool new uh, new uh, latest version the SN30 Pro Bluetooth Gamepad. Um, it's actually got a Hall, uh, hall Effect joysticks, um, which are better quality joysticks. Uh, let's just go ahead and look at the back and see what it's capable of. So you can see there, guys, uh, it's pretty compatible with most devices here. So it will work on a switch. You can see there. Uh, Windows device. There's a Bluetooth protocol there. Uh, it will work on Android 9 and above. Uh, also, Apple, Steam, and Raspberry Pi. So it's pretty decent for compatibility. This is the uh, crystal purple version, as we can see. We're going to go ahead and unbox this. Um, it looks pretty cool. I'm really excited to check it out. Um, so let's go ahead and unbox it. Let's see. If it's sealed or not maybe it's sealed or maybe it will just slide off try this way just give me a moment guys or I'll just check seal there you go so it did just slide out oh I do like that Color is really cool. So let's just quickly have a look at the box. You get the manual in the box, guys, as usual. Um, pretty straightforward and a Type C cable. So that's what you'd normally expect in a box, something like this. I'll just put the box away. It's got that protection cover on it. Let's just remove that. Let's put that away. I do like that color, color though, guys. The color is really nice. It feels light in the hand as well. Um, it's not too heavy. Very nice indeed. And it's got them nice colored purple buttons as well. Very nice indeed. Let's try and get a zoom in for, for you guys. You can see the buttons there. So you got your start, your select. D-pad feels very nice indeed. Firm. And then um, all sensor joysticks, uh, I can see the difference in them. They do feel really nice and they spring back to the middle very nicely indeed. Yep, and they have them pushing ones as well. L3, L4. Let's have a look at the back. You can see the back there. It's all transparent. And the bottom, and there should be a switch. There you go. Uh, that's the wireless switch and the uh, Type C. But that one will tune in. You press that, it will tune in the analog stick. Uh, when you want to, uh, you know, connect it to your device. Very nice indeed. And then you have your buttons on the top here. Um, left and right shoulder buttons, uh, R2 and L2, there you go, very nice indeed, I think I'll have fun with this one, so I will check it out, set it up on one of my emulation uh, devices to, um, you know, really test it out and see how it performs, but I do like them sticks, they feel really good guys, compared to my other 8 uh, device these feel really nice yes so let's just put that one aside um, 
and let's move on to these little things. I'm just going to put some lighting on, guys, because it's getting dark in here. It was a miserable day outside today, but uh, pretty surprising for summer. Uh, we just had rain, rain, and rain, unfortunately. So these are the um, replacement uh, analog sticks that he's gone out and sent me, uh, gill kits. I'm just going to quickly show you uh, what they are on, on the website. While we have this up, just quickly show you here on my little laptop. So basically, this is the Steam Deck version uh, of the kit. But they uh, he's gone ahead and sent me the Xbox, uh, the PlayStation Five, and the PS4 ones as well. Uh, you can buy them off Amazon, and these are. The Steam Deck ones I'm showing you currently right now. So there's no soldering to be done. They just plug and play, guys. You open the uh, Steam Deck and you just replace them. You you plug them out and plug these in, and they're meant to be uh, a lot better. Just quickly show you. That's the main picture there. So you, like I say, you do have different versions. So today we're just going to go ahead and unbox them. And see what you get actually in the box. Uh, gill kits, gilly kits. So we got a PS4, we got an Xbox. We got the Steam Deck for OLED. And we got the PS5 or the Switch Pro controller replacement. So we could go ahead and unbox them. Let's go ahead and do the uh, the Steam Deck one first. I will put the links in the video, guys, so you can buy these. Once again, thank you to Jim for sending these out to me for a review. That, that's the actual kit there, what you're going to get, guys. Pretty straightforward once you open your Steam Deck. You just drop this little uh, thing in and replace your current one. And uh, everything will be on the uh, manual how to replace it. You obviously have ribbon cables here, which you may need to attach uh, to the device. But these feel really nice. Very nice indeed. And apparently you can change these caps very easily. They're very easily changed, easily removable. So you get a set of them guys, that is the Steam Deck OLED uh, ones that we've unboxed there. So quickly checking out the back, on the back of the box, just quickly have a look at the back of the box. Um, this joystick, let's see if we can, this is kind of like shining a bit. Module is used for joystick replacement on the Steam Deck OLED. The joystick cap has touch sensor functioning, a patented uh, electromagnetic stick, super smooth and long working life. So that is the uh, gully kit for the Steam Deck OLED guys. So that's one out of the way. Uh, next one we'll do is the PS5 replacements or the uh, switch controller so you get the actual sensors in the box let's zoom in on this that's what you get so they literally just drop in you can see there and you get the caps the nubs, whatever you want to call them, which go on there. And just to show you a PS5 controller, guys, I have my PS5 controller here. And these are direct replacements for your PS5 controller. If they start wearing out or need replacing, you can go ahead and drop this little bad boy in. 
uh, to replace them. Uh, and again, all the manuals will be, uh, you know, instructions in the manual of how to fit this. And that's one set that you get there. So let's just put these back away. Uh, so compatibility on this one is Switch Pro and the PS5. So it will work on either one of them. And if we look at the back and just read, uh, the kit is only for repair use on game controllers. Low power feature, same as carbon film joystick. High durability uh, and long life by contactless and wear-free TMR sensor. TMR is uh, effective only for a single direction of magnetic field lines, providing better interfa uh, interferences, uh, resistance, uh, KK ring joystick cap for easy stick cap replacement that I showed earlier and super smooth. So that is the uh, TMR joystick kit for the PS5 or the uh, Switch Pro uh, controller guys. So let's put that one out of the way. Next one up, uh, a PS4 kit. Just show you the back of the box there so you can read it. Later on, just pause it and read it. Say, be going through it again. And let's get this one boxed. So this is your replacement kit for the PS4 controller. And you get a whole kit in there. And that's the, uh, pretty similar to what the PS5 one is. And then you get your caps again that just sit on it. Uh, e easily replaced caps as well, these top caps. So that is the set of the PS4 guys. Like I say, I will put links in the description just so you guys can uh, check them out. Away. And the last one up is the Xbox Series controller. Let's check out the back. If you want to pause that, guys, just so you can read. And then let's do the unboxing. Same again. TMR joysticks. These are all TMR joysticks uh, by Curly Kit. And this is the Xbox controller. As you can see there, uh, one top cap and one knob. There you go. Let's zoom in on that. Very, they're all very similar. Just uh, your cap there as well that goes on the top, and that is a direct replacement for the Xbox. Oops. There you go. Direct replacement right there. So that is that, guys. That is the uh, Xbox controller replacement joystick. So I hope you enjoyed the video guys, that is the uh, the full kit that was sent to me um, for the uh, replacement joysticks and the 8-bit old device, right there guys. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and we will see you soon.